This tutorial involves the different pack methods for the EPH 20 series being EPH 20, 25, and 26. Reloading primers is similar to shot shell reloading in that the powder charge is measured by volume rather than weight. Primer compounds are usually measured using the single pack standard. For small primers and large primers, add one level cup of the EPH 20 compound. Use a skewer or similar instrument and lightly move the material into the bottom of the primer cup. You are mostly making room for the anvil. It is acceptable to skip the installation of the disc with the EPH 20 series. As stated, EPH 20 dries to a quick drying concrete material and hardens quickly after activation. The double pack. In practice, the members of MIWI desired a stronger primer than the standard pack of EPH 20 had to offer. The solution was to simply add more powder. As before, fill the primer cup to the brim. Use a skewer again but this time pack it rather hard. Add more EPH 20 powder to refill the cup. Use a pointed skewer or similar to make room for the anvil. Seating the anvil won't be as easy as before and the anvils sometimes want to pop out. So using a pointed skewer to pre-dent the powder will help. This last one I've not personally tried, but this method was passed on to me by a respected member of MIWI, so I'm including it for the sake of completeness. I call it the pack in the half. As before, fill the primer cup to the brim. Use a skewer again, but this time pack it rather hard. Fill it to the brim and level the powder off a second time, but this time leave the powder loose, not packing or tamping the powder down at all. Install the anvil into the loose powder and activate it as is. You may opt to install a disc to help keep the powder in the cup. Normally speaking, you should use EPH 20 for small pistol primers and EPH 25 or 26 for small rifle primers and magnum primers. You also have three packing methods for each one, so you have a lot of options and choices. As a beginner, let's keep it simple and use EPH 20 in a small pistol primer. This is Mark on ArdvarkReloading.com. If you have the financial means, donations on Patreon would be appreciated, but not required. Details below. And if you have technical questions, please join me at the MeWe group called Primer Reloading. Hope to see you there.